Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. I am here for Let's Craft My Stash number two. You are going to be able to vote at the end of this video on what I use in my next Craft My Stash DIY. All right, everybody, I am back with our second Let's Craft My Stash video. Um, I will explain in the description box and at the end of this video how you will vote. Um, but I first wanna show you the items that you will be choosing from. Some are returning from last time. A bunch of them are new things that I did not have in my first one. So let me first of all show you what I have here for you to choose from. And again, these will be listed in the description box as well. Returning once again is the set of Our Nest is Best burner covers. I have two of these um, straw wicker, I don't know what you call these, Easter baskets with a handle. I have two of these hanging plant baskets hanging wire baskets. I tried to do mostly things that are available a lot of times of the year, but there are a few seasonal items. I have two of these flowers and garden galvanized metal buckets with little short handles on them. And I have two of these are a little taller. They don't say anything and they have the jute twine around the top. So I have two of those as well. All right, another new item. I have two of these. They look like a flower to me, these mirrors that hang. These are from Dollar Tree, of course. Um, I think I only put stuff in here that was from Dollar Tree this time, no thrift store items. All right, here I have four of these wood frames with the galvanized metal and the little clip at the top. I have two pool noodles. Thought that would be kind of fun. Throw a couple summer items in here. These are returning. These are the plastic um, buckets that look like wood, these little planters. Another summer item, I have these little shovels. They have a wood, real wood handle on them. Down here, I have two of these. They're like the wire plasticky cabinet shelves with the little rubber feet on the bottom two of those. Speaking of those little wire baskets, I have one that's this little tiny one. Let's see, it's three by eight and three quarters by two. I have one of those. And then I have six of this one. This one is 12 by six by two inches high. So if you like those organizer baskets, um, this is jute twine. Now this one is from Walmart, but we all know there's jute twine at Dollar Tree as well. Returning again are the two sets of salt and pepper shakers from Dollar Tree. I had no idea I had this many canvases from Dollar Tree. I've got two of the 8x10, two of the 5x7, and eight of the 6 inch by 8 inch canvases. So if you choose canvas, make sure you tell me what size, or if you don't care, just say any size. All right, I did bring back these tall Happy Easter signs only because I still have four of them since I only used two in my last project. A few more things that are new. I do have some of the tumbling tower blocks here, some of these wood beads from the craft section at Dollar Tree. I have a variety of these metal um, trays. Let's see, I have four of this circular one. I have two of the rectangular ones and one of these pretty oval ones. I decided to put back in these, um, what do we call these, shadow box frames. I do have six of them. For some reason I only put four out, but I do have six. And a few more things. The two pizza pans are returning. And the two placemats. Always stay humble and kind. And home sweet home. So the way this is going to work 
is you are going to comment on this video and you are going to choose three items that you want me to use in one project. Okay, before I tallied and from the tallies chose the top five items, but this time I'm going to choose someone's comment and use those items in my DIY. So a little bit harder of a challenge for me, I think. So what I'm gonna do is I'm actually going to choose three winners and then I'm going to choose the person whose items I want to use. Does that make sense? So three people will still be chosen to win some sort of little giveaway, but I'm going to let myself choose of those three whose items I'm going to use. I hope that all makes sense. Read the description box if you need more clarification. All right, so I'm posting this on Tuesday, April 14th. So I'm going to have voting open, let's see, Tuesday, Wednesday, let's do by 10 p.m. Thursday evening. So that's the 16th, April 16th, and this will be in the description box. I'm just continuing to show you what you can choose from here and also remember to check the list in the description box. All right, guys, I'm so excited for Let's Craft My Stash number two. Give this video a big thumbs up if you are enjoying these Craft My Stash videos and be sure to comment with your three items you want me to use in one project. All right, guys, talk to you soon. Bye.